so this is your base r system for this base r system we can able to define uh, two ways of complement form so one is r minus one's complement form and second one is r's complement form already we discussed it for binary system so in that binary system we can able to define one's complement form as well as two's complement form so if you apply for any base r system so we can able to define two ways of uh, complement form so that is r minus one's complement form and r's complement form for example if you are considering decimal system that means base uh, 10 system for that system we can able to define nines complement form as well as tens complement form nines complement form is nothing but r minus one that is 10 minus one's complement form tens complement form is nothing but r's complement form where r equals to base 10 so if you take any a number system like uh, base 8 system base 16 system base 3 system we can able to define only two complement forms right and next one so i will take one example then you will get clarity right this complement forms are purely applicable for only negative numbers representation just you should remember that point so don't blindly apply for positive numbers so this is minus 132 base 10 first i will go for nines complement after that i will add plus 1 to this particular nines complement form then i will get tens complement form first we will find nines complement form so how you find out this nines complement form just you can remove this 132 number from all 9 already in earlier session we discussed it okay if i want to find out one's complement form of any negative number just simply you can remove that number from all ones right in the same way here also if you want to find out nines complement for this particular negative number just you can remove this number from all nines then you will get nines complement form number for that you can add plus one then you will get the tens complement form in order to find out the tens complement form we have alternate way also that i will discuss later so first we will find out the nines complement form for this negative number here we have three digits so i will take the three nines right so i will take uh, three nines here and after that i will mention one 132 here just i can remove this 132 number from all nines nine minus two that means you will get seven and nine minus three six 9 minus 1 8 so i am getting here 867 right so this is your uh, nines complement form number now i have to add plus 1 to that particular nines complement form number so this is uh, 867 here i am adding plus 1 so 7 plus 1 means 8 6 and 8 so this is your tens complement form number so if i want to find out uh, tens complement form for this uh, minus 132 so in previous case uh, whatever the thing we done that is indirect method so first we can cal calculate nines complement form after that we can add plus one then you will get a te uh, tens complement form that is purely indirect method when it comes to direct method so don't take all tens previous section what happened if i want to find out nines complement form just i can remove this 132 from all nines so tens complement form direct method means uh, Blindly, what you have to do means uh, just you can remove this 132 number from all tens. That is completely wrong. Okay, so instead of all tens, you can take thousand. Okay, we have only three digits, so I can take uh, so one zero zero zero. You can remove 132 from thousand, then you will get 868. That is a uh, tens complement of a given number. Next, I will take one more example. That is minus 32 base 8 system, right? Base 8 means uh, we can expect sevens complement form as well as eights complement form. Eight means r's complement form. Sevens complement form is nothing but r minus one, where r equals to eight, right? So first, we will find out the sevens complement form. So how you find out this sevens complement form? Yes, you can remove this 32 number from all sevens right then you will get the sevens complement form that is uh, uh, 7 7 and 32 so if i am uh, removing this 32 from 77 i am getting 45 right 7 minus 2 5 7 minus 3 uh, 4 right so this is your sevens complement form number i want to find out uh, eights complement form so just you can add plus one to this particular uh, sevens complement form number then what you will get so 45 plus one we are getting a 46 so this is your eights complement form so if i am taking a direct method for eights complement form so eight means what r equals to eight this is your ace r system if i am taking decimal eight which is equal into one zero 
base 8. If I am divide 8 with base r, then I am getting this 1 0 in octal form. That's why I am taking 1 0 0. So from this 1 0 0, I am removing this 32 number, right? So this is 32. But don't think this is not a, a decimal one, decimal uh, addition or decimal subtraction. This is octal, right? Octal representation. So if I am removing from this 0 to 2, we are unable to do that uh, subtraction. So that's why I am taking one unit to borrow uh, from here so that I will get 8 here, okay, not 10. In that decimal case, uh, we can treat as uh, 10. But in this, so actually, we end and take 8 decimal ni octal represent jesu now, right? Octal represent jesu and tell so this is a decimal 8. So, din ni manam. Actor uh, convert chayali and ante base R to success division uh, method ni follow them. So base R equals to eight. So eight ones eight so one zero. So manaki actor lo one zero uh, representation and the manaki got generate out of right one zero that means eight uh, base ten equals to one zero base eight representation. So that's why I am taking one zero zero here. So here I have two digit number, so that's why I am taking one uh, double zero. Already previous section look example solve this. So man ki kada okay uh, actually zero nun chale two ne subtract chale hum kawati manam okay unit ni kano chale uh, baro thesis kunta. Previous section lo ekta ni ten ka consider jaisa, but ekada ekta eight ka consider jaisa. Okay? Why? Because this is octal. So that ekada manam okay unit ni baro thesis kuna tarvata. Idi eight ka convert hoti thi. So eight minus two ante man ki kade mostly six. And ekada uh, Previously, 8 is 8 is the unit of the unit. The present is 7, right? 7 minus 3, 4. So, this is 46. So, you should remember only one thing. If you have 1, 0, 0, you decimal to the decimal. You have to the decimal to the decimal. First of all, we have to calculate the number system. We have to calculate the good pet. Okay, if you have to convert the octal, you have to each and every digit 8 club. We have to consider also. If you have a decimal, you have to 10. 10 minus 2, you have to convert the previous position. You have to convert the previous position. 9 have to convert the 9 minus something. Remove the octal. So, but octal, you have to remove the 8. So, previous section, you have to convert the 7. You have to convert the 7. You have to convert the remaining thing. You have to subtract the octal. अगर वेला बेस फाइव सिस्टम मन कोणी दाने फाइव का कंस्ट्रक्ट चार सोचते हैं प्रीवियस सेक्शन के लिए ना बारह तीस इसको ना प्रीवियस सेक्शन लो फोर का उन्नत है फोर में जिले सब्सट्रैक्ट में जाएगा इस तरह ये दी प्रोसीजर वो वेला मिकी दाने कंफ्यूजन का उन्नत है ना कुंटे का ना सेवेंस कंप्लीमेंट फॉर so this is about number systems and their complement forms. Okay. So manam most of the situation binary number system matter me deal jaise tham. Kavate manak ones complement and twos complement matter me use out hindi. Yawani kora intent hai just idea ko samante. Right. This is decimal subtraction. This is one example. How you use this nines complement form number and as well as tens complement form number and how it is helpful to this particular computation. Right. So now. First, I am using a uh, nines complement form number. The subtraction with the help of uh, nines complement form. Okay, so this is uh, 197 base 10 minus 132 base 10. Already the decimal lo provide chesa arga vatti. Mana ke decimal uh, subtraction ana di easy. Mana day to day life lo use chesa arga vatti easy to calculate chesa. Okay, problem in lega. But in case octal number system provide chesa arga vatti. Le do ante hexadecimal number system provide chesa arga vatti. Le do ante base r equals to 5 system provide chesa arga vatti. Ala ante situation lo calculation ana di ante simple ga ondo. Whether it is subtraction ga vatti. Le ante addition ga vatti. So subtraction somewhat difficult. In that situation. तो आ नेगेटिव नंबर इधर तो मन का कड़ा प्रोवाइड चेस आरो आ ने आ नेगेटिव नंबर ने कन का मनम कॉम्प्लीमेंट फॉर्म लो की कन्वर्ट चेय गल गिते मन को ओरल का एडिशन मात्र में जेनरेट होते हैं अंडे एडिशन मात्र में यूशियल्स होते हैं एक अलग पूरा सब्सट्रैक्शंस यूशियल्स ना स्कोप होना है इधर त when it comes to this, uh, 132 number which is a negative number. This negative number is represented in the 9th complement. Direct 9th complement number is 
డెసిమల్ నెంబర్ని యాడ్ చేసేస్తే మనకి రిజల్ట్ ఎండ్ అనేది వచ్చేస్తుంది ఓకే ఆ రిజల్ట్ ఎండ్ని ట్రూ ఫామ్లోకి కన్వర్ట్ చేస్తే మన రిక్వైర్డ్ ఆన్సర్ అనేది మనకు వచ్చేస్తుంది ఫర్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ ఈ వన్ నైంటీ సెవెన్ మైనస్ వన్ థర్టీ టూనే ఇక్కడ కన్సిడర్ చేయండి నార్మల్గా డెసిమల్లో మనం ఆ క్యాల్కులేషన్ కనుక చేస్తే వన్ నైంటీ సెవెన్ మైనస్ వన్ థర్టీ టూ సో బోత్ ఆర్ డెసిమల్ నెంబర్స్ సో జస్ట్ అబ్స్ట్రాక్షన్ కాబట్టి మనకి సెవెన్ మైనస్ టూ ఫైవ్ నైన్ మైనస్ త్రీ సిక్స్ వన్ మైనస్ వన్ జీరో దిస్ ఈజ్ యువర్ రిజల్ట్ అండ్ రైట్ సిక్స్టీ ఫైవ్ బేస్ టెన్ ఈస్ ద ఆన్సర్ దాన్నే మనం నైన్స్ కాంప్లిమెంట్ ఫామ్ యూజ్ చేసి ఎలా ఫైండ్ అవుట్ చేస్తున్నాం అనేది ఇక్కడ చెక్ చేద్దాం ఓకే సో ఫస్ట్ వన్ థర్టీ టూ నెంబర్కి నైన్స్ కాంప్లిమెంట్ ఫామ్ని ఫైండ్ అవుట్ చేయండి ఫర్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ ఫర్ దిస్ మైనస్ వన్ థర్టీ టూ బేస్ టెన్ సో నైన్స్ కాంప్లిమెంట్ ఫామ్ నెంబర్ సో నైన్స్ కాంప్లిమెంట్ ఫామ్ ఆల్రెడీ ఫైండ్ అవుట్ చేసాం బట్ ఎనీవే మళ్ళీ ఒకసారి ఇక్కడ క్యాల్కులేట్ చేస్తున్నాం చూడండి సో Just you can remove this 132 number from all 9s. Then what you will get? 9 minus 2, 7. 9 minus 3, 6. 9 minus 1, 867. This is your 9s complement form number. You can take here 197 base 10 plus 9s complement of 132. So, 867. So, 197 base 10 plus 867 Base 10 only, right? So, if you add this, you can add this. 197 and 867. 7, 7. 7 plus 7. So, 14. As you can place 1 here. So, this will act as carry. Okay? So, 9 plus 6. 15. 15 plus 1. 16. So, here you will get 1. Now, you can add these three numbers. 8 plus 1, 9. 9 plus 1, 10. So you will get a zero here and a one here. So this will act as carry. Okay. This one will act as carry. So you can add this one here. So four plus one, five and six. So this is your resultant. R minus one's complement form lo make a carry generate aita a carry in next stage lo add shells into an important note. Whereas in R's complement form, in case carry is generated by the true magnitude form. This is true magnitude form, right? So this is your true magnitude form. In true magnitude form, in case carry is generated by the direct ticket R. This is the R minus 1's complement form. Okay? Base 10 system, we have only two complements form. One is 10's complement form, that is R's complement form. And second one is R minus 1's complement form, that is nothing but 9's complement form. Because 9's complement R1 that is decimal number system. S5 is also not available. 9's complement form R1 is not available. So, the given number system is a decimal number system. Well, 1's complement form R1 is the given number system is binary number system. In case 7's complement form R1 is automatic, that is base 8 system. అది మీకు ఐడియా రావాలి వెంటనే ఆర్ మైనస్ వన్స్ కాంప్లిమెంట్ లో క్యాల్కులేషన్ అనేది చేస్తున్నావు అని అంటే ఇన్ కేస్ టూ మ్యాగ్నెటెడ్ ఫామ్ లో క్యారీ జనరేట్ అయితే ఆ క్యారీని నెక్స్ట్ స్టేజ్ లో యాడ్ చేసేసి రిజల్ట్ అని తీసేసుకోవాలి ఇన్ కేస్ సేమ్ థింగ్ ఆర్స్ కాంప్లిమెంట్ ఫామ్ లో చేస్తున్నారు అనుకోండి మీకు ఇక్కడ క్యారీ జనరేట్ అయితే దాన్ని సింపుల్ గా డిస్కార్డ్ చేసేస్తాం ఇగ్నోర్ చేసేస్తాం ఇక్కడ ఒక నోట్ అయితే మీకు ప్రొవైడ్ చేస్తాను సో ఇన్ ఆర్ మైనస్ వన్ కాంప్లిమెంట్ ఫామ్ క్యారీ షుడ్ బి యాడెడ్ టు ది ట్రూ మ్యాగ్నెటెడ్ ఫామ్ దెన్ యూ విల్ గెట్ ది రిజల్ట్ అండ్ నంబర్ In case of R's complement form, carry will be simply ignored, right? So, this is, uh, so once you check uh, normal decimal calculation and uh, nines complement form calculation. So, here we are getting 65 based on, here also we are getting 65 based on. For this uh, same computation, we can use a tens complement form also, okay? Next one, by using a tens complement form. Tens complement form of this 132 is uh, 868, right? So already in previous example we calculated and 197 base 10 plus 10's complement form of 132 base 10 that is 868. So 197 base 10 plus 868 base 10. So what you will get here 197 and 868. Okay. 7 plus 8 that means 15 carry 1 here 9 plus 6 15 15 plus 1 16 so you will get carry here so this is 10 so 0 and this is 1 this is your carry so this is R's complement form so that you can ignore this carry right discard it then you will get uh, 65 is the 
answer already i gave a statement for r minus 1's complement just you can add this carry to this particular true magnitude then you will get resultant number in case of r's complement form if any carry will be generated simply you can ignore that carry so you will get the resultant number so with the help of this complement form you can perform only addition only okay that is the advantage while using these complement forms <laughs>